So I'm going to show you a pattern from Lubos Rosa, and he calls it the mouse fly. Um, so it's black and red coloration with a pink bead. Lubos reckons it's very effective in summer, effective, uh, especially fish quite high up in the water. So I'll show you how to tie it. So first things first, just going to fix the bead in place. So I'm just using a little touch of fully mill super glue. And we just push that bead up into the glue. So um, the hook we're using is the um, fully mill short shank jig hook in black nickel in size 20. Um, and I've got a 2.8 millimeter slotted pink uh, metallic bead. So first things first, just catch on the tying thread. That bead is moving about a little bit, but the glue will catch it and stick it in place. Um, so I just want to remove the tag piece of the thread there. Okay. So the rib on this fly is just some fine red holographic tinsel. So just catch that in and then we run our thread in touching turns slightly around the bend of the hook only a little bit and then we just build up a little bit of a body with the tying thread nothing too crazy okay and just take your um, fine red holographic and just rib it up the fly in open turns. And then we just catch that off. Just got to be slightly careful with this because fine tinsel over thread bodies, it can slip a little bit. Um, so I'm actually just going to drop in a little bit finish at this point. Because just for security, uh, we're going to add a very thin uh, UV resin finish to the body. Um, just the uh, fine holographic over thread it will not last at all so just add a very thin coating okay Can use any uh, any fine uh, UV resin for this Interesting thing there you might be able to see is that these um, light pink metallic beads they're they're actually fluorescent as well. Okay, so now that's cured. That's cured. Um, we just need to do a CDC hackle on this. So just find a CDC feather that looks the right size. Okay. Okay, happy with that one. So we take a CDC feather, put the fibers in a clip, chop off the stalk, make a little dubbing loop. So add the twister into the loop. Then we just add the fibers of the CDC. Up into the loop. And just twist that up. Just 
switch off the dubbing loop there. And just finish the fly with a little touch of peacock ice dub. Tiny little touch of it. Add a small bit of super glue to your thread. And then just whip finish. Okay. So that is the pattern from Lou Boss Rosa and it's called the mouse.